the love. It's at Taylor Hansen's house. The Hansen musician and wife Natalie welcomed their sixth child, a son named Claude Indiana Emmanuel Hansen, on Wednesday, December 26, in Tulsa, Oklahoma, his rep confirms to People exclusively. Our new little man, Indy, is the best gift our family could imagine. His arrival brings with it a new sense of adventure and excitement for the future, the couple tell People. Baby Indy joins big sisters Wilhelmina Willa Jane, 6, and Penelope Penny N, 13, plus brothers Viggo Mariah, 10, River Samuel, 12, and Jordan Ezra, 16. Aside from his siblings, the new addition has a bevy of cousins to play with including Uncle Zach Hansen's four children, daughters Mary Lucille Diana, 2, and Junior Rose Ruth, 8, plus sons George Abraham Walker, 5, and John Ira Shepard, 10. Oldest brother Isaac Hansen is dad to daughter Nina Adette, 4 one half, plus sons James Monroe, 10, and Clark Everett, 11. Want all the latest pregnancy and birth announcements plus celebrity mom blogs? Click here to get those and more in the People Parents newsletter. MMM Tots. Your guide to the ever-growing Hanson family tree. The couple announced their baby news on Instagram in August alongside photos of their entire family. What's better than being a dad of five? Perhaps being a dad of six, the string theory musician and budding photographer captioned his outdoor snapshot. Baby E. Hansen coming in December and we are over the moon. Taylor told People exclusively at the time, Natalie and I have always kept a love of adventure and pursuit of rich experiences at the heart of our family. There's no greater adventure than welcoming a sixth little person to our tribe. Natalie posted another photo of their brood, surrounded by musical instruments, captioning it, Taylor and I are so thrilled to share the news that baby number six is coming this December. Ezra, Penny, River, Vigo and especially Wilhelmina can't wait to be big brothers and sisters again. The new mom of six shared a few glimpses into her pregnancy on her Instagram account, including photos from the spouse's NYC baby moon in November, an aside view of her baby bump on December 17, captioning the latter shot, It's been real, it's been fun, but... While chatting with people about his and his brother's latest String Theory album and tour, Taylor said he was very excited about being a dad again, and that as far as parenting duties go, he and Natalie have always struck a balance that is embracing the unbalance. You can't really control the fact that I'm often on the road and you have to do the things that you want to see happening, raise a family, being one very big one, regardless of the craziness that surrounds it," he continued. We'll definitely have a little bit of quiet time when the baby's born, thankfully, but the life train will continue to move quickly, so we'll be excited to introduce them to this family they're entering, which is pretty much on the move all the time," added the this time around crooner. Asked whether baby number six will be the couple's last, Taylor, himself the second oldest of seven kids, admitted, we've never had a preconceived idea of how many children we would have. We just love our kids and are not afraid of taking on a bigger family than we have. We're just one at a time. Taylor Hansen and wife Natalie expecting sixth child. In a November blog post for Nameberry, Natalie, who homeschools the couple's children, opened up about her passion for names and the challenge of the more children you've named, 
the more of your favorite names you have probably already used. There also came the hurdle of fielding different opinions from her larger brood. As Natalie explained, I want the older ones to feel invested and respected and at the same time not saddled with the ultimate responsibility of parenting, or in this case naming. Therefore, I am now in the process of listening and debating and mostly just trying to appreciate how lucky this baby is that their name matters to all of us. I can leave you with a little hint, she teased. Both our top girl and boy choices right now are main characters in George Sand novels. Happy guessing. <laughs>